Okay, I'm going to demonstrate, uh, go through module one here on the Google Drive course um, and demonstrate all the things I've got to do, hopefully in one take here. So switch between tile and list view is quite simple right here. I'm going to just switch between the two. There's tile, there's list, and there's back to tile again. Um, the next one says create a new document. Easy enough to do. I go in here and create a new, uh, new document, Google Doc in this case. Pulls up a new screen. It's a simple document. I'll call it, once it pulls up here, it's loading, loading, loading. So it's working. It's taking forever to do, so we'll just move on. But there, I've created a new document there. Create a new folder. Same thing, I'm going to go new. I'm going to create a new folder. And I'll call this one, we'll call it Google drive class for whatever this class is um, we'll create a folder for that I'm supposed to assign it a folder color so we'll, we'll double click here because I'm using a Chromebook we'll go down to change color scheme and we'll make it a nice I don't know what color that is um, and it should then be that color when I click away from it the nice folder will be that reddish color um, and then it says create a subfolder. So to do that, I'll just go into that folder. I'll pull up that simple folder and then I will just add a new folder and call it module one. Simple enough. Demonstrate two ways to move a document into a folder. That's easy enough. One way is I simply hold down and drag something over to where it goes. The other one is um, if I double click on a Chromebook or right click on a PC and go to move to, it'll pull up a list of all my folders and I can drop it into the folder just like that. Um, share a file from the drive menu. So I'm going to share this file right here, we'll say. So again, I'll right click or double click on a, on a uh, Chromebook and click on share. I'll enter one of my other email addresses that I have too many of and send. And now that will say, are you sure you want to share with them? Yes. And then it will be shared with that person. Um, explain the shared with me folder. The shared with me folder is where other people who share documents with me, those documents automatically go here. They don't go into my drive until I want them. So these are a bunch of student uh, met, uh, papers and PowerPoints and things like that they've shared with me over the last year or so for class. So there, that's how that works. And it says, um, move a file from shared with me into my drive. So I'll just simply hold it down and drag it over to my drive. And then I can choose where I want to drop that into. So in this case, I'm going to drop it into my Google Drive class. Just like so. And there it is. Um, and so now it'll be inside of that folder. It says upload a file from your computer. So to do that, uh, I've got to go to new here and file upload. Um, because I, this is a Chromebook, I don't have any files on here, but I did plug in a USB drive just to show how to do this. Um, this um, Iwo Jima picture, for example, we used in our Veterans Day Assembly last week um, is one. I guess I need it. Yeah, anyway, so that's uploaded now uh, here into our folders. If I go down, it'll, there it is. The Iwo Jima picture is now in my drive. And that says um, convert a Microsoft Office file into a, um, into a Google Doc. So let me see if I can find one real quick that I haven't converted over. Um, this reading vocab document right here is still an Excel document. So all I'll do is I'll right click on, on it, or in this case, double click, excuse me. And I'll say open with Google Sheets. And by doing that, it automatically will create a Google Sheet instead of an a Excel document. It'll convert it over to a Excel document, or into a Google Sheets document, like I said, instead of Excel. Um, and it, formatting will be a little different, so it's always one of those you have to adjust sometimes to make it look a little better. But there it is now, saved in our Google uh, Sheets, or as a Google Sheet, excuse me. And I think that is it. Thank you very much.